Hi everyone! So today I'm going to be showing you how to do Meryl Davis's free dance look from 2010 Worlds. And yeah, it's just a really easy, pretty purple look. Yeah! <laughs> Okay, I don't even know what I'm saying, but I don't really have much other to say. So I guess we'll just go ahead and get started. Okay, so first we're starting with Beauty Control Shadow Control Cream, as always. And get a little bit on your finger and go from lash line all the way up to your brow bone underneath your eyebrow. Then, wipe it off, <laughs> um, take your black eyeliner, and I'm using Beauty Control's Color Freeze Eyeliner in Midnight. Oh, my least favorite part. Whew, okay. Yay. watery eyes. Okay, so next, I'm for this look, I'm using, I was debating on whether or not to use this quad that I'm using. I'm using the Amethyst Smokes quad by Maybelline. I was debating whether or not to use it because, I mean, it's not, I have colors closer to what she's wearing, but I want it to be something more affordable, you know, where all the colors are like right there for you. So, that's why I chose to do this way. So it's not exactly like how Meryl's is done, but um, it's pretty close. So first you're going to take this brow bone color, which is right here, from this quad. And, sorry, I have gum in my mouth. I just realized that. Just ignore it, because I'm not going to spit it out. <laughs> um, and you're going to put it on your brow bone. And in the corner of your eye here, and then up through there, too. Okay, now you're going to take this lid color here and go as close. This, like, it's really pigmented, but it doesn't spread easily, I guess you would say. So go as close to your lash line as you can whenever you put this on. Okay. Hmm, that's a little bit dark. Oh well. What ups? Um, wipe off your brush. And then go back in with the um, brow bone color. And put it right here in the middle-ish of your eye. You know. I guess you'd say middle-ish. I don't know. Just to lighten it up a little bit, because Meryl's all over lid color is a bit lighter than this lid color in this quad right here. Um, and then go in with the crease color right here. And put it in your crease. Gosh, my lighting in here is so awful, I can barely see what I'm putting on. Like, there's just such a huge shadow over here. Hope it's going on okay. Okay, wipe that off again, and then last we are taking this outer corner color, which is just a black, and we're going to put it on the outer corner of our eye. Or of my eye, not our eye. <laughs> this is mine. <laughs> um, yeah. This isn't really very pigmented, so you might have to get a lot on there.
Okay, now I'll go back in with the brow bone color and just kind of blend right here. Itchy. I feel like I have hairs everywhere all over me. Okay. Now, yeah, it looks kind of lightish. Here still doesn't look quite light enough. I would go back in with more of the brow bone color here and I'm just patting it on there just to lighten it up a little bit. Okay, next. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I'm going to use my black eyeliner again. And oh, I feel like I have so much fallout right there. Maybe I don't. Maybe it's just the shadowing. I don't even know. Um, but yeah, I'm going to line my eye here. Ooh, it's really watery for some reason. I'm not even that close to my eye. Wow, I am so hungry. I haven't had anything to eat yet today. So I'm really, really hungry. I really want an Arby's um, salad. I love their, what is it? Farmhouse turkey and ham. OMG, yeah. I love that. It's my favorite. And then kind of wing it out here a little bit. Okay, now take your eyelash curler and curl your eyelashes. Now take your blast your blascara. <laughs> take your mascara. I'm using Beauty Control's Spectaculash in black. And yeah, put it on your lashes. Okay, now do your bottom lashes. And just lightly go over them. Or I guess if you wanted it to look really dark, you could go over them really dark. But I don't want them that way, so yeah. Okay, so I think I'm done. Yeah, I think so. Um, for lips... Dang it, I feel like I have hairs all over me. Um, for lips, I... No, she kind of has a bright lip on the in this look, and I wouldn't. I don't think I would wear it out since I have so much purple on. I don't think I would wear it with the bright pink lip that she has. But for these purposes, I guess I'll go ahead and put it on. Don't that? No, not that color. I guess we'll go with this color. Okay, so for Meryl's lips, I'm going to use um. Pink Peony by um, by Maybelline. Um, I know she put lip liner on and stuff like that, but I'm not planning on... Con I'm going to go somewhere after I do this, so I'm not planning on continuing to wear this with this the rest of the day, so I'm not going to put on lip liner, so that way it'll be easier for me to take off. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, my hair won't stay out of my way. And I haven't done my hair yet. BTW. So, yeah, this is it. This is my Meryl Davis 2010 Worlds Free Dance makeup look. And I hope you had a lot of fun watching me. I had a lot of fun doing this. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!